Ladies and gentlemen, good morning. I'm honored to welcome you to the UAE, and I thank you for choosing the Emirates to host the AIBC Summit, the largest and most prominent event dedicated to entrepreneurship in the blockchain and artificial intelligence sectors. Some of you are visiting us for the first time, and for those of you, I'd like to welcome you to the UAE, but many of you have made this first visit long time ago and are now an integral part of the entrepreneurship ecosystem we have established and are constantly expanding and developing. Encouraging entrepreneurship has always been central to the UAE's development strategy. Various measures have been implemented to ensure that this strategy succeeds, from allowing 100% foreign-owned businesses and offering extended visas to entrepreneurs, to providing funding and support for smaller businesses and attracting tech businesses to the UAE. These efforts have come to fruition, and the UAE ranked first regionally and fourth globally in the Global Entrepreneurship Index 2020, outperforming several major economies. The SME sector has grown considerably over the years. It now accounts for more than 53% of the country's non-all GDP. That's a percentage that we expect to continue growing in the years ahead. While our efforts to support entrepreneurship span every sector, one sector in particular increasingly stands out, and that is advanced technology. The UAE has been a trailblazer in adopting technologies of the fourth industrial revolution, most notably blockchain and AI. Our leadership has launched the national program for AI to define various initiatives collaborations, partnerships, and breakthroughs in the field. In the UAE, our ambition is to become a world leader in AI by 2031, creating new economic and social opportunities for citizens, governments, and businesses. This, in turn, can lead up to 335 billion dirhams in extra growth. We've also introduced an ambitious blockchain strategy to migrate government transactions towards the, black for the blockchain platform and establish the UAE as a world leader in digital adoption. This strategy is expected to save the UAE 11 billion dirhams in transactions and documents processing, as well as 77 million work hours every year. The UAE has long championed innovation as the main ingredient to success for governments, companies, and individuals alike. But perhaps never has innovation been as important as it is right now, while the world works to recover from the COVID-19 crisis. Indeed, the pandemic has underlined our urgent need to move away from paper transactions, service centers, and cash currencies towards advanced digital platforms. This has transformed the entrepreneurship sector, bringing investments in technology to startups like never before. Here in the UAE, we are doing everything we can to create an environment to support such ventures from the launch of the Dubai Future District with one billion dirham fund to the creation of a dedicated tech space in Abu Dhabi, Hub 71, earlier in 2019, to the ambitious Government Accelerators Program, which includes Ghadan 21, a three-year development plan with 50 billion dirhams were essentially positioned the entire country as an incubator for SMEs and entrepreneurship ventures, particularly in technology. Ladies and gentlemen, I thank you once again for being here and for bringing the ABIC Summit to the UAE. Our country is always prepared to offer a platform for bold, promising ideas and projects. I look forward to the ideas that will be brought to this table over the next two days. Thank you.